If you want to help out the channel, you can head over to my Patreon, try to get yourself a mug, sticker, or a tote bag. There are tier systems set up over there. I will put the link in the description, and make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss any of my live streams. I do exclusive giveaways. You can try and get yourself a Zippo, and also I'll have a PayPal link in the description too if you want to donate to the channel that way. Hey everybody, how you doing? Got a video today that uh, I hold important to me and uh, I think I needed to make for a long time and I haven't really. But this is my video, why you should use an armor, why you should buy an armor, why you should go get one now if you do not have one. Because they're the best Zippo you're ever going to own. And if you don't own one, let me bring you through why. I'm going to go into detail about all of them. But first I'm going to introduce you to them all. Uh, starting from this right one here, this is one... Uh, custom I did we don't have to worry about that but this is a chrome armor right uh 167 high polished chrome armor heavy wall okay it'll have these markings on the bottom this one's a 2017 D it won't be a can bottom it'll be a flat uh I believe they moved I don't have a new armor from this year but I believe they moved some of this around so this is what you're going to see for those years uh this is a high polished brass armor it is broken though, but you can see right there, heavy wall, high polished brass armor. Uh, it is broken. I broke this in a live stream. I broke the hinge off. And uh, I took a, fair, a four barrel hinge off of a 41 replica because I believe they are the strongest hinge. And I'm going to solder that on. And I'm going to make this a four barrel armor, something they do not have, something Zippo hasn't i've emailed them they said they're not making one they're not gonna blah 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 so there's not one out there i'm making one uh stay tuned for that video in the next few weeks and then as we move on we have a gold plated armor this is the 2018 collectible of the year oh, it was right the first way sorry i wasn't looking uh this is the collectible of the year it has the zippo limited edition logo on here uh armor again 2018 collectible of the year the insert matches on this uh, all the inserts for here will be a february 2018 because that's when they made these uh and it comes with a gold plated insert and i have to say guys oh man uh this is three years old got it has gotten heavy use it is uh, usually never cleaned you can see some of the gold plating has scratched off there from opening and shutting it so many times but on the bottom of the lid uh the gold plating has held up very nice on the insert though uh that is very impressive uh like this is three years old heavy use you can see from the inside that this thing is just black and i'm gonna clean this and then i'm gonna have a video on how to clean your gold plated inserts um that's that's incredible that is incredible how well that's held up that's just amazing let's take it out take a look uh, even here the scratching like pretty impressive uh and this gets a lot of use this one, this one really does uh you know and for how expensive this lighter is it's funny that you know it's even getting used but you know i'm glad it is uh but you can see here uh, now this has been in and out of pockets lots uh use this uh oakley lens pouch it fits a zippo perfect and it's a scratch proof pouch right so it's actually good to keep this thing when you're carrying around your pocket you don't want those big scratches this has been dropped it has little dents in it that are very hard to find because of the engraving all around it, right, on the corners and stuff. But there is one somewhere. I just, <laughs> I just don't know where it is. I'm sorry. There is one, though. I, uh, it's hard to see, though, but it is somewhere. It was, I think it was on that bottom side. But regardless, the gold-plated Zippo inserts, I'm telling you, hold up really well. This is three years. Pretty good. Uh... And then on the very last one here, we have the Armor Solid Silver. Uh, now, the the Armor Solid Silver has not gotten as much use as this gold-plated one. Uh, I tend not to bring this out as much. Uh, there was a while when I carried around every day for months, but uh, I stopped doing that. You can see here, it does scratch and everything like that, but it's still high polish. You see my reflection in there. Uh, I don't know. The inside is very clean extremely clean because i keep it clean i just use i just use water to clean it distilled water from like a bottle or something like that and just a q-tip on the inside 
but now I've been using butane insert in there, so it doesn't really have to get dirty unless you're using a regular insert. Okay, so now I've, I've introduced you to all the different type of armors you can get, okay? And then that's really, that's really all you're going to want are these ones, right? Uh, the multi-cut, deep engraved, they're just beautiful pieces of artwork. Like, I, I wish this was a regular lighter they sold and just not a collectible, uh, you know, 1100 of 12,000, so... Uh, they, these are these are expensive to buy now, but they do have other versions. You don't have to get that one. They do have other gold plated armors. But the reason why you're going to want armors, I'm going to show you. I dropped this from about four and a half feet. Like you can barely make it out on camera, but they're actually a see that. Wait, if I hold it over the white part, see how it flattens there. See where it's round here, but then it flattens there. I dropped that from four and a half feet on concrete. Boom. A any other Zippo I've ever done that with has put a massive dent in it. Like that would have dented the lid, the lid very, very bad. All I got was that tiny little scratch, probably from a rock that I landed on, and that small dent. Like you can barely see a dent there, but it is there. You can see it has been flattened. But, and that's why you're going to want a Zippo. It's just uh, an armor Zippo. It's just more resistant to dropping. It's more durable. It feels good in your hand. The weight of these things uh, are just amazing. And the, the ping you get from opening one too. I just love that ping. It just rings. You know what I mean? Like it go, it like echoes. It goes for a while. Uh, but another reason why you're going to want these too is because... It, they're just better quality <laughs> you know wouldn't you want something that was a little built a little tougher a little better like these are one and a half times thicker than a regular zippo so uh i i personally tend to only ever really carry an armor and i personally only ever tend to carry brass uh i the other side of this is i took all the chrome off and it is brass right all the way around but uh brass is the best or silver i like silver a lot solid silver but these are so expensive now i paid 120 dollars for this and i bought this brand new in 2017 paid 120 dollars for it now they sell for 400 american what's that canadian 500 dollars canadian so i've been hesitant to use this one right like i, I i'd want to get another one that's how i feel i just i don't know i'm I, I don't like using something if I don't have two of them. You know what I mean? I don't like going out with them. I don't like doing any of that if I don't have two. So it's very frustrating. Uh, but they do sell other civil, silver Zippos for cheaper, but they're not an armor. You know what I mean? You got to get the armor. I just, uh, th this Zippo, I love it. And I just, I want to use it again, but I won't use it until I buy another one. So I'm going to get another one. Uh, but everyone... That's pretty much the reason why you should use armors, but there is one more thing. You gotta watch, the hinges are weak. Uh, that's what happened to this one here. That's why it broke. The hinges are a little weak. Uh, and this is why the hinges are a little weak. When you take something that is built for something one size and then you add weight to it and then keep the hinge the same size, well, now there's a lot of play. And if you go on Reddit or in my comment sections, you'll see most people have issues with the five barrel hinge that's on the armor. The armor needs an upgrade. Uh, you know, we got to email Zippo or something and tell them, hey, you know, we all love the armor Zippos, but the hinges are too weak for it, you know? And they probably get a lot in repair. Like they're they probably noticed this too. They're like, man, people send back armor Zippo for hinge repair all the time, blah, blah, blah. Uh, they, sh they should probably do that. And that's why I'm making a four barrel armor because I just believe the four barrel is uh, superior than the five. Uh, unless they were going to make like a five barrel hinge from like the 60s, then then I, I would get behind that because that is a very beefy, very beefy hinge. Uh Oh, I don't, I have it put away. Sorry. I'd have to, I'd have to go get it. There's no time. But, uh, so everyone go get yourself an armor Zippo. Like I say, it's my everyday carry. It's what I like to use. I highly suggest you do too. Uh, go get it, go enjoy them. Uh, the price keeps going up on these things. I used to, I, well, I originally bought this armor high polish brass for $12. Uh, now I can't even, I, in Canada, I can't get it for under 50 bucks. Like I can get it for like $40. But after taxes and everything like that, it's still 50 bucks, right? So 50 bucks is 50 bucks. Um, 
way she goes uh get on these they're always going up it seems nowadays especially in the economy we have now so make sure you get on these armors now these silver zippos have been jumping up in price like crazy go out and get them before they jump up anymore it's just uh, i don't know i'm buying a few and that'll be the last i ever buy <laughs> because i did there's not even there's not even five hundred dollars worth of silver in here so why the hell is this five hundred dollars i don't understand there's this whole thing weighs 60 grams so what's 60 grams two ounces of silver and what's silver right now it's like 40 bucks canadian so it's i don't know what's that 29 dollars american an ounce or something 30 dollars an ounce so there's 60 dollars in silver in here maybe 70 you know <laughs> How how the hell is this a five hundred dollar lighter? I don't understand. I, I don't know. If someone can explain that to me, please. And from the Zippo factory, I know you guys are gonna have great comments and suggestions. But someone from the Zippo factory, explain to me why this lighter is five hundred dollars when there's only seventy dollars worth of silver in it. Like I don't understand. So guys, go out, get an armor. Take care. I'll see you in the next one. Hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions or anything like that, ask me below in the chat.